I'll tell you one thing. I, there's one prediction that I make I've not been wrong on yet. You guys want me to give it to you? Yes. I've not been wrong on this to this day. I've not been wrong on this. Well, yeah, what am I doing? I'm giving you all the come, giving you all the ME subjects, and because you're guaranteed to get 25 questions on each. Never been wrong. Except when we had only 100 questions. Well, but I dumbed down my prediction. All right, real property, uh, crim pro, crimes, we'll call them crimes, uh, contracts, UCC. What am I missing here? Missing one more. Uh, evidence. Con law. My favorite. There you go, guys. 25 in each. Okay, here's the thing. Since we are guaranteed these, and this is one half of your exam, we're going to focus a lot on them. But I'd rather focus on things that are going to be there or not. And check this out. Bet you didn't know this. Out of the five essays, got set in stone, the most likely thing is three of the five will be based on these subjects. A minimum, they've never done less than two out of five. In fact, they've never done less, you know. And sometimes they'll do as many as four out of five will be based on this subject. And if each essay is worth, now this is what statistically average, I'm a math guy, uh, statistically average, three of the five essays will be on these subjects, all right? Which is why we spend all the time on them. Each essay is worth how much percent of your grade? Does anyone know? 7.14% of your grade. 7.14% of your grade is every essay. So, if you have two essays that are not based on the MBE subjects, that's 14.3, that means 85.7% of the exam, why do you think we spend so much time on them? They're the backbone of the exam. At a minimum, it's going to be 78 to 79% of your exam and B subjects, all right? Closer to more 85, 86%, even sometimes 